Okay guys, uh, you saw my other video basically with my 2S LiPo setup and now this is a quick video of my 3S LiPo setup. I'm going to be giving a running video of a 2S LiPo setup with a small battery with a bigger 2S LiPo battery and then with my 3S LiPo battery so I'll do a video to show you what it's like running on its standard battery and then with a better 2S battery and then with a 3S battery. As you can see the bodywork from my first video is slightly different. Whereas when I'm running 2S I can run my setup inside the car slightly different. And I have slightly different options with fan or just the heatsink. Whereas with my 3S LiPo setup, if I'm running 3S, then I have to use this bodywork where I have the front window cut out so my EC sticks out slightly through the bodywork as it's so big the body won't go on without me making a slight cut out. But pretty cool because the air's hitting EC pretty hard on. So I will be putting a little mesh in there, stop stone getting in. But at the moment, as you can see from the big battery, I have a 3S running across the side of that. So yeah, it's uh, running 3S at the moment, so uh, gi give you a quick look inside. As you can see the body works just fits on. And as you can see my AC is slightly askew because of the height of the battery. It lifts it slightly up when it sits in the middle. Servo down there. Metal Gear Servo, Prius LiPo, all fitting in, just fits in. Had to cut away some of the lip just so I can squeeze it in, but it just fits in. As you can see, the height of the battery, if I can show you that, is just slightly higher, as you can see from inside. So it's slightly lifting the EC up a little not a major body work goes on and it still runs but I'm getting maximum performance it sits a little better with the metal chassis and so forth the plate being slightly bigger and so forth it actually sits a little better but working with the plastic sh chassis and that it's um, a little bit more of a squeeze but it still works so as you can see you can run free as lipo in here but I will be changing my EC it's only a 60 amp EC I'm putting 120 amp EC in the EC into this so I can run 4S in here you can put 4S in so this will go then to 4S and I'll show you a video of that when I do make that change when my EC comes this is my A959B brushless upgrade minimal upgrades to the car itself keeping it as original as possible to keep the weight down and running it on 3S LiPo 65 to 130C discharge 2200 milliamp battery yep it's ready to go stay tuned running video next